Hello and welcome to Swiss Watch King. Today we're here with another review for you guys and we're going to be talking about one of my favorite pieces in the collection at the moment which I wear most on the weekends because it's a special watch for me. We're going to talk about the Konstantin Chaikin Joker watch. The Konstantin Chaikin Joker watch has been a favorite of mine since I first saw it at Basel when it was launched in 2017. It's made by the well-known Russian watchmaker Konstantin Chaikin, which who is a brilliant watchmaker who has over 60 patents in watchmaking. So a really incredible guy, very innovative, and he makes incredible timepieces, not only the Joker, which was arguably his greatest achievement and the crowd favorite probably, and really put him on the spot of watchmaking. Mr. Chaikin is currently also the president of the Academy of Independent Watchmakers, and is doing a really good job also on social media, boosting the visibility of the Academy and its members. When we go back to the watch now, the watch dial is something that really intrigued me and really made me happy when I saw it in person. Because I'm a very happy guy and I, I love to smile all the time and be positive about life in general. The watch really spoke to me because it had this fun factor about it, you know. The whole watch is a homage to Joker, the character villain from Batman. So the whole watch is basically a face. Uh, with approximately 20,000 different expressions because when the eyes and the tongue move each position is a different expression of the of the face so how you do that is if you look at the dial it's constructed out of nine different parts it's very complex all handmade in Russia uh, by Mr. Chaikim himself so the dial has two types of guilloche one on the face, which is the white one, and the nose is also a different type of guilloche. Let me explain to you the watch itself, how the time indication works. So you have the eyes for the time indication. This is the hour eye, and this is the minute eye. Um, and the tongue acts as a moon phase indicator, which you can manipulate through this little hole in the case. Let me show you how. You press it and you can see clearly the tongue is now disappearing. And now it's going to reappear from the side. So this is a very nifty feature and I personally love it because it always changes during throughout the day. The case itself is meticulously finished as well. It's a very traditional looking case, but it has its sporty angles. For example, like I said before, the, the two crowns which are used as a, the ears of the face are actually functioning. Of course, this one is used to set the time and to wind the watch. And this one is used to set the moon face indicator. The case is mainly brushed with a few polished details, like on the lugs, you can see that the edges are a bit polished and the rest is brushed. All made in Russia as well, the case, which is incredible. The bezel of the watch itself is very meaningful as well because it represents luck, which is the joker, the spades, the hearts, diamonds and the clubs, which you can see here laser engraved around the bezel. Because I love this watch so much, I asked Mr. Chaikin to create a piece unique for me and because I travel to Asia very frequently and I love it, I asked him to hand engrave a guardian lion in the back to protect me on my journeys. So as you can see the guardian lion is hand engraved on the case back and is also polished to give it this 3D effect. As I explained before, the majority of the case is brushed, as you can clearly see on the side of the case. With a big exception of the lugs, which are polished, and the back of the case, which is also highly polished. To give it this contrast to the middle, like medallion. For the movement, Konstantin Chaikin used the very well-known ETA 2824-2 movement. But because he had to create in-house modules for the moon phase complication at 6 o'clock and the 
time indication discs. The power reserve is now 38 hours instead of the usual 42 hour power reserve, which I don't mind, but just a fact you should consider when you're buying the watch. Constantine Chai can really focus on details. So with the strap he created for the Joker watch, there is two sides to it with different colors. So the front is a black alligator and the back is very soft purple cuff leather with green stitching throughout to make it more comfortable and also to keep it in tune with the whole design of the watch. The buckle is also highly polished titanium. We all know titanium is a very hard metal which is very difficult to polish. So it's, he took incredible care into designing it and nevertheless in titanium and polish it and laser engrave his logo in the buckle as well. It's a normal tank buckle, but very easy to use. And again, we're all used to tank buckles. The size of the case for me is perfect for a suit or just a casual outing in the, the city or the weekend. To put it on, it's very comfortable. It's a normal tank buckle. So you just strap it on, tuck it in, and voila, you're good to go. The size for my wrist is perfect because it's a 42 millimeter and also very comfortable because the lugs also hug the wrist nicely to give it this extra perfect feel. On the side, you have a picture of a watch we'll review next. If you think you know which watch this is, comment down below. Thank you again for watching my videos and stay tuned for more.